take on the family. Happy hump day. Uh, yeah, you ever, when that damn camel would come on, I would always, I would always give a little laugh every time I saw that camel. Uh, happy Wednesday. Listen, uh, we're going to take a look at Pinky's new video, uh, but I do want to go back to this other one, uh, you know, just kind of do a little, little look-see, see what's going on. And have I mentioned lately that I need to do a new intro? Lord, I'm there's oil change, big lot, shop with us, vlog. Mm -hmm. uh, here's your contribution uh, there, Pinky, so I don't forget. All right, you guys, we're making us some eggs. Don't they look good? Mm, not really. Um, I don't know if it's the color uh, as far as the camera, but um, if these are fresh eggs, like, I don't know. They, don't, they, they look odd. From a nurse to a chef. <laughs> Now look at that, from a nurse to a chef. Mm -hmm. Well, listen, Pinky, if Megan is taking um, any kind of nursing classes or if she is um, any kind of a nursing assistant, whatever, uh, yeah, that's pretty bad. But no, not to a chef girl. Uh, to your cook, to your housekeeper, uh, to your Uber driver. Listen, that girl's 18 years old. Uh, Megan, listen to me. Uh, girl, live your life now because um, you won't see 18 again. Before you know it, you'll be 50 years old, and you're going to be sitting around uh, thinking back on all this stuff, and you're going to have regret. You're going to be pissed off that, listen, uh, my younger years and everything, when I could have been out experiencing the world, I was in the sardine can uh, helping uh, that jackass oh, pinky. Yeah, you have lots of jobs to do. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Lots of jobs. Uber driver, housekeeper, um, uh, grass cutting. Um, uh, uh, cooking, uh, that she, uh, you probably got her cutting your toenails, girl. Uh, you ought to be damn ashamed of yourself uh, working that girl, having that girl doing all kinds of stuff. When does she have time for a personal life? When does she have time to have fun? I know damn well she's not having no fun with you. She can't be having any kind of fun with you, Pinky. And I hope we ain't gonna be doing damn dishes. Uh, let's just, uh, let's go uh, skip through here a little bit. Mm, what's that, shish kebabs? <laughs> it has to be the color of the camera. Like, her food can't be looking like this, like this pale. Well, check out. And I'm gonna get these fries killed. This is my eggs with a slice of cheese. That's all I mean with it, Joe. Just this. Yep. Uh-huh. Uh oh, so now, uh, because Megan's around, now you're eating better. Now you're not having no carbies and, and, and stuff. Uh, okay. Now you're um, not low carb Lola. You are a uh, protein patty. I don't know, y'all. Oh, God, shit. I just throw work together sometimes. Um, but yeah, after that video you made the other day, but I guess since somebody is around, and they are around more than you're alone, so girl, you should be dropping the poundage. The kebabs aren't quite done yet, so I got them done for just a few more minutes, and then they'll be ready to eat. Okay, guys, oil is changed. Now we are at Big Lots. So we'll go in here and take a little look. I love this Big Lots. It's really nice, clean. Not been in it in a few months, I think. It's been, it's been a, at least a few months since we've been here. Nice and white in here, guys. Let's go out of the restroom. Um, see, there again. Pinky, can't you go to the restroom uh, before, uh, you know, before you leave the house? You know, uh, girl, they probably see you coming in there and taking your ass back to the bathroom. And they're thinking, oh, Lord have mercy. I hope she's not dropping some big doo-doos back in there. Oh, my. I don't like using public restrooms. I won't use a public restroom unless, you know, I, I, like my bladder feels like it's going to explode. And then I will. Now, look, I would admit, Big Lots has, um, they have some decent stuff in there. Some of those, uh, some of that stuff right there, now that is cute. Uh, that would be something, uh, that I would purchase. But, uh, let's, let's kind of go through here, see how long she gonna be in the Big Lots. Lord have mercy, she gonna be the whole damn, uh, who's that? Oh, mm. oh, hell, look, that looked like a skinny you, Pinky. Uh, but we're not gonna do this whole video. These signs are cute. I like them. Got a cart. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that. <laughs> I gotta get my fall stuff out before I start purchasing things. <gasps> That's the cutest ever. Let, let me be honest. I like that too. But here's the difference between me and you, Pinky. The, see, that wouldn't go in my house. I wouldn't put that up on the wall. I wouldn't set it up on the TV, on the uh, nightstand, uh, on the, uh, the end table. No, see, that would go outside. What I would do is I would uh, do some bales of hay, some corn stalks, uh, some pumpkins, you know, do a little decoration like that. And I'd have that maybe sitting, you know, somewhere in there. But no, see, I wouldn't put that up on the wall. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I hate to admit it, but yeah, Pinky, that is cute. And this little one right here, the, the white pumpkin, yeah, that's cute. Too. I would buy that. Oh, so is that? Look at that. Yeah, nobody. No, ma'am, no, sir. I wouldn't buy that. I would, no, I don't like that. I don't like that. Oh, oh, look. They got my initial. Oh, I wish that Tim's. They just got CKJ. 
She, this is a what, 46 year old woman? Yeah. Well, listen, Pinky, uh, that could C could stand for crystal, or it could stand for carbs, or you could get, uh, I don't know, you could get the K too and put them together, and um, I mean, I don't know, uh, carb king, uh, that would work. Um, uh, carb kills, uh, I don't know, I probably shouldn't say that, but yeah, carbs can kill you, eat too many of them, like $1,500, uh, yeah, $1,500, Lord have mercy, 1500 carbs a day, uh, uh, so that could work, that could be a reminder, uh, to you, Pinky, but let's not be done with this, because, um, hey. and it's kind of boring, let's go to the new video, cleaning my mobile home with me, Tim working on the car vlog. Oh, Lord, I hate these cleaning videos. I really, really do. But listen, we need a proof of life from Tim. So, um, we're going to go ahead. We're going to take a little look through it and uh, see what Pinky's going on as far as... Uh, here my contribution, Pinky. Come on, Cece. Uh, I know you're struggling, but you got to come along, too. Good morning, y'all. It's coffee time. So, I'm sitting here drinking my coffee out of my gray smoky mountain cup. It's so hot outside, you guys. Huh? <sighs> Jesus. Let me take a deep breath. Pinky, please. Please, for the love of all that is sacred. Listen, girl, at least, uh, yeah, I, yeah, I know, Karma family, what you're going to say when I say this. But at least put the camera, like, I'd rather look at the side of your big ass head than look at the, the girth down here. I mean, this is the same view every single time. I mean, girl, what you, maybe you could put the, uh, put the camera on top of the TV and, and we could get, like, a wide shot of you or something. But, girl, just the same view all the time. I can't do this. This is for life. Oh, listen, remember when she said about how nobody had noticed her haircut? Well, look, she got her hair down. Uh, listen, uh, let, let, let me point this out here for a second. Uh, you see? Yeah, you see here? Uh, now, Pinky, that is uneven. I mean, I don't, I, I don't need to comb it out and, you know, do the finger trick and everything. That is uneven. See, that is why you pay $20 to get a professional, uh, somebody who knows what the hell that they're doing with it. Uh, girl, did you change the color of your hair? I, I, I prefer you as, uh, you know, blonder. I really do. I don't know. I don't know what this. Maybe this is your real hair color. I don't know. So I did it last Tuesday, but I didn't film it. Okay, now I got to go back. Sorry. See, I'm not wanting to watch her wash dishes, but then when I see certain words up on the screen, now, damn it, now I got to go back. Get it prepared here in a bit for everybody. Everybody can just have them some whenever they feel like it when they come home. Like right, sending out of the way. And I can film it for y'all. So I did it last Tuesday, but I didn't film it. I got already filmed some kind of video, I think. For y'all, so. Okay, she's not talking about anything. I, I don't know what the hell she's talking about filming. She didn't film something. I, I have no idea. Oh, well, what you talking about a trigger for? I think I said uh, the word trigger a few times in a video from just a couple days ago. I'm pretty sure I did. Let's see what you're talking about. Certain YouTubers you just can't watch. They just trigger you, don't they? They do me anyway. I'm like, yeah, I can't. I cannot watch ya. Trigger, trigger, trigger. Uh, okay, Pinky. So, let me get this straight. Now you're saying certain YouTubers you can't watch because they trigger you. How do they trigger you, Pinky? Be does it make you eat? Because a few days ago you said the reason why you eat, you know, boxes of macaroni and cheese, is because when you're by yourself. Uh, well, now it's certain YouTubers. Well, here, Pinky, listen. Lord have mercy. Let me take a deep breath. <sighs> Here's what you do, Pinky. Don't watch people that trigger you. Just like you shouldn't be coming over to my channel and reading the comments and getting upset that you can't have a hug box uh, over on my channel. No, Pinky, you ain't got a hug box over here uh, on the Karma channel. So, why do you come over and read comments and then you want to be a big-ass toddler and, oh, I don't like that comment. I'm going to report it. I'm going to flag it to YouTube and everything. You know what I did? Yesterday, I was able to go over and, and catch one of uh, Frenchie's uh, videos, one of her live streams. And listen, I, I looked through the comments to see what people were saying about Chantel. Mm, mm, uh, far, far worse than what you see on my channel about you. But I don't think, I don't think that uh, Chantel's flagging comments. I don't think Amber, Lee, Amber Lynn Reed flags comments. But you do, because you want to be a big old whiny baby. A big toddler. A snitch. To run to YouTube. Somebody told me that they got, time, I guess, timed out for 24 hours because of a comment that they made. Now listen, y'all. 
there may be a few comments that get past me, but I'm telling you, for the most part, the comments that I read, they aren't vile. You know, they're straight to the, some of them are straight to the point, but they're not vile comments. You know, I will, I, honest to God, I, I don't even see, I might see damn or I might see shit. You know, a word like that. But I don't see, I don't see that F word or anything else in the comments with the Karma family. But now listen. I'm not going to go and tell anybody what they can write and what they, what, I, well, I, we don't do that over here, okay? I, I'm not going to censor anybody. You know, I did see a couple people uh, that said, you know, maybe that they should dial back as far as what they put. Look, that's absolutely up to you. Listen, this is the United States of America. We have free speech. The only thing that I would ask is that maybe anyone new coming in, you know, uh, you know, please don't cuss, don't, you know, let's not do vile. Now, I don't have to tell the OG Karma family that, because like I said, they don't do that. They, they, they are very truthful, but they do it very classy. But, uh, you know, uh, Pinky gets in her uh, fifis, and, you know, she got to run to YouTube, because uh, she wants a hug box. Well, girl, that's what you got a channel for. You keep that hug box over there. Just want to eat more. Thank you. Well, girl, you just keep racking up the excuses. I eat more if I'm by myself. Uh, I eat more if I'm watching uh, certain uh, people on YouTube. Girl, you got an excuse for every damn thing. You know, uh, Pinky, you eat because you want to eat. You eat uh, because you obviously like uh, eating a whole box of uh, macaroni and cheese or a whole thing of Oreos. Don't be blaming it on e everyone else. It's not Tim. It's not Danielle. It's not Megan. It's not anybody on YouTube. It's you, girl. It's all your fault. It's your responsibility. You put that stuff in your mouth. So, uh, quit with the lame excuses. Hold on. I'll show you guys something that I did, got yesterday. Dollar Tree yesterday, you guys. I didn't show you guys what I got because, well. <laughs> I got. Yeah, Pinky, you got. Uh, you got no taste. Uh, look at this right here. D that, don't you think that needs to be filled up with some caulking? I mean, something like that. Because, see, this is the sink. And, uh, I mean, that's a pretty nice gap right through there. Uh, you need to be having Tim get on that, put some silicone or something in there. Uh, these things right here, are these like them sticky decal type thingies? You know, you peel that off of there. Are you seriously going to put that in your bathroom, Pinky? You know, do you, do, is there anybody in the sardine can that doesn't know um, that when they use the toilet, especially a man, uh, to close the lid? What's this say down here? Uh, floss and brush your teeth. Is there anybody in the sardine can? Do you have to tell Megan, Danielle, or Tim to floss and brush their teeth? I don't know, Pinky. Maybe it's a reminder to yourself to do it. But like I said, tacky. Just tacky, tacky, tacky. Oh, and while I have a better view, um, you can see all the scratches. Remember when you just kept telling everybody, Pinky, that um, these countertops, uh, that they are scratch resistant? Uh, clearly, no, they are not. Barely um, a little to nothing. I got this thing I thought was super cute. You know, it's supposed to do like that. Hang in your bathroom. I thought that was super cute. Then I got a few dog bows, uh, some um, flaws. That's all. Only spent a few bucks. Nothing that I thought was really worthy showing you, but this. Well, yeah, uh, in my opinion, you could have saved this. I would have rather seen the new dog bowls. Uh, that's just my opinion. But like I said, there ain't nothing cute about this. Well, I, say, I wish Mr. Carmel would be walking in the house with something serious. like this. Hey, baby, I picked this up. Thought Very you could good. put it in the bathroom. I wouldn't even have to say anything. I'd just give him a look. Give him a side eye that tells him so that, uh, uh, well, maybe I'd give this uh, as a maybe gift to somebody. Or, yeah, just go ahead and let me throw it in the trash. I'm not definitely not going to hang them like that. But I thought, then again, they might look silly, not hung together. I don't know. No, Pinky, it's just going to look silly, okay? Uh, you, Tim is almost 60. You are 46 years old. You do not need this type of stuff in your bathroom, okay? It's just tacky. Ooh, Lord have mercy. So cool. mm. Pinky, I wonder when you sit there and look in that camera. I don't know. You look in that camera like you're doing that, you know, like they say about uh, Chantel, like, or not, or the salad, the guy salad, that he eye. Uh, you know, doing himself. Y'all know what I mean. He eyed doing himself. Pinky, that's kind of the impression I get. And girl, I don't know why. Or maybe you just have that look like, Lord have mercy, look how big my head is. I can't tell which one it is. Okay, you guys, I'm cleaning. And I'm getting uh, everything all dusted down. What do you mean? You guys need to clean too. I got the kitchen all done up. So I'm wiping off all this because, oh, it's dusty. It's dirty. And I need to clean the TV off too. You know, I see some smudge marks on it. That's probably just from where we moved it. And then I need to Strip everything down off the island to do it. I will probably um, ask Megan to do that. Probably. 
Oh, there won't be uh, any problem. There won't be any probably. She will definitely uh, get Megan to do it. You know, of course she will. Uh, Pinky, I want to know something. Uh, is is that a washcloth or a dish rag? And uh, it just looks wet. Huh? There she. <coughs> are done hacking. Um. Pinky, I mean, are you gonna? I, I mean, usually like you get get the dust off, and then you you know your furniture oil. Uh, but I mean, are you using a? Well, I guess it don't matter if it's an old washcloth, so I, I shouldn't be snooty as far as that. But it looks wet. It looks like pretty wet. Like you just taking it from doing dishes and took it over there and wiped that stuff off. He's wiped. Just a mess. Kind of like a little spring clean. You know what I mean? Anyway, all these tables off. Uh-uh. No, that's not spring cleaning. Uh, if that's how you spring clean, then you don't know how to you don't know how to properly clean. Uh, spring cleaning is you take every damn thing off. Everything off, the walls get done, everything. Pinky, uh, listen. I don't know, maybe you weren't taught right, but you know, they got they have YouTube videos um uh, of people that will show you how to properly clean. Chargers. Uh, let somewhere. me get a closer look. Uh, look at all these scratches. These are scratches. Listen, Pinky, tell Tim, because, you know, uh, you got him doing every damn thing else. Tell Tim, take this table outside, uh, sand it down, give him a little hand sander. You can get one of them bad boys at the Walmart or I think even at Lowe's for about 25 bucks. Cheap, little handheld. Sand all that finish off there, girl. Get it nice and smooth. Get you some good varnish. And, and with the, um, <laughs> it'll come to me. You know what I'm talking about. The, the, the stuff that makes it shiny. Get you a good, uh, get you a good stain. And have Tim redo that, and that table will be nice, Pinky. Why would you have a table there in your living room in full view with scratches? Weren't spilling our backs there. there. Lord have mercy. Hold on a second. The whole damn thing, I thought it was just a little bit up there. Uh-uh. No, 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 no. Listen, there, you there. tell Timmy, tell Timmy Karma said, take this table out, sand it down good, and get you a nice little stain, like a honey color or something like that. Pinky, why would you have this in your, your living room? Now, uh, granted, it, you probably don't get anybody to come over. Maybe your sister. You know, so maybe it's no big deal to you. But, uh-uh. See, I like to find stuff like this. You can, you know, you can buy stuff like this, like really cheap yard sales, whatever, and I get Mr. Karma to refinish it and stain it. Look brand new. Look, looks expensive, too. Listen, I'm not rich, okay, but I enjoy taking something like junk, but taking something, you know, you see something and some people don't see it, but I look at something and I think to myself, boy, I could bring, I know I could make that nice. Listen, and nothing listen, wrong with that. I know people who have taken, I know a woman, listen, shut up, Pinky. Listen, I know a woman who took this old, this thing, this thing was a, like a dresser from the 40s, maybe like 40s, early 40s. I tell you what, that thing was in rough, rough, rough shape, okay? By the time she was done with that, oh my God, that thing looked like I guarantee you she probably could have got herself a thousand dollars for that. Beautiful, beautiful. That's the kind of stuff I love doing, Pinky. So listen, uh huh. There's your back scratcher. Um, remember that time uh, uh, Chantel took that uh, took that back scratcher and used it as a fork. Mm. Uh, Pinky, I don't believe that you would do something like that, you know. But I, but I guarantee you, you can't reach your back. And uh, Tim probably not scratching your back though. And so check him for a candy. Yeah, uh, you need to take this table too. And tell Tim why he's taking that other one out there and tell him to do this. Girl, he could do it in a day, in less than a day. You know, with a hand sander and then it, and he could make them really, really nice. This one here not too bad as far as the finish. Tell him to take that other one. Look, do that dark stain. Oh. Get, do that dark stain on that other one. I need a tissue. And then I'm going to get the, uh, my uh, other vacuum out. Now, see, I was right. Remember the other day on that video, I said that Pinky was probably sitting here with the pillow. Mm-hmm, yeah. Uh, Pinky, what you got that pillow sitting there for? I mean, it, it's it, it's either two reasons. It's either you you sit there all damn day long, and you got to have that push, uh, that cushion uh, to, you know, um, soften your ass from sitting there all day. Or, I don't know, there's a big indentation, and the pillow is to, you know, kind of um, cover it and, uh, you know, keep you from sinking down in. It's one or the other, Pinky. And, uh... Clean down the couch, couches. I usually just get the uh, thing and do that with it. That's about it. That's back breaking for me. But guess what? It's all be done. I forgot. I forgot to do the brown shelf. Oh, mercy. Did I have a... Well, Pinky, I noticed um, you didn't do, like, you didn't really do a good job on the, um, you know, the bottom parts. Like, uh, you know, I didn't see you bending over or squatting down or anything like that. But, yeah, yeah I, I imagine that's a lot of weight on your back when you do that. Yes, I'll be in. Okay, guys, dinner is over. Go ahead and look at the garden. 
And we'll have to water it here in a little bit. It's, it's really cooled down a lot. Tim's out here. Changing the light bulb on our blue car. That's what we call them, blue and black cars. How's it going? Hey, Tim. What is it? Up it up. I can't see how Hey Tim, nice to see you. Nice to see you're still around. Nice to see you're still kicking. Uh, listen, um, Tim, look Tim. We can only get that little glimmer of him right there, but um, his little fake wedding ring, uh, wedding band. Excuse me. Uh, Piggy, I don't think Tim wants to be bothered. You know, men when they're working on cars, and then you come up with the camera and everything. So, uh, yeah. Oh man, you figured out which honey buns. You know, men don't like to be bothered when they're working on cars. They really, really don't. And she comes up to him with the camera, and, you know, uh, Tim's probably just thinking, well, you know he heard her coming, so, you know, in his mind, he was thinking, oh, Lord have mercy, here she come. Hope she ain't got that damn camera with her. Yeah. It's nice it's not. Very. Okay, well, we'll look at the garden. We'll be back to check it out in a minute or two. I'm not going to water it yet. So I normally don't water it until... The sun goes completely down. Looks like we'll be cutting grass tomorrow, too. Yes, yeah, sir. Pinky, you ain't cutting nothing uh, but a piece of cake. Uh, I present to you the uh, Amazon jungle. Mm-hmm. Hey. Mm. Oh, as soon as the sun goes down, too, we're going to get out here and pick some more tomatoes. Yes, we are. Or everybody get out here and pick some. Yes, they will. Our garden's very dry, and I'm trying to bring it back to life. Your garden's very dry because I swear y'all wait till it rains for it to get any uh, water. Uh, you ain't bringing that back to life. Uh, I see a couple of your little, I see a couple of pumpkins there, Pinky. Mm. Uh, them squash and everything. Yeah. Yes, I am. There's our cucumbers. I don't see any cucumbers. That's part of the watermelon. 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 Mm, I don't know. I'm pretty sure that uh, I'm pretty sure you're not going to be getting any watermelon. Uh, these are very small, Pinky. They need to be a lot bigger, you know, in order for them to be. Um, yeah, yeah. I, I, girl, don't take this little itty bitty watermelon and take it in and cut it because uh, you will, will be very disappointed. Watermelon. There's a big one in there. There's two there. One more there. Pumpkin. These pumpkins are looking good. That's nice and green and pretty. Oh, that's, that's grown just since last night. Then we got one there, two there, I mean, and one way over there. You see them? But yeah, we got a lot out of it. We're going to do the cute cut or the watermelon too. So. Girl, I'm really, really, really very, almost 100% sure you're not going to be eating any watermelon. But listen, look, let me point this out right here. Okay, this is only a section of Pinky's yard. Okay, Pinky, you could be, when you're by yourself, you know, you could walk this yard. Beautiful days, especially we're going to be coming into cooler weather and everything. Girl, you could walk around this a couple times a day. Over here, across your little bridge, all that over through there. I ain't going to lie. I will not lie. That's a nice yard, you know. I, I don't think much of the sardine can that sits on it, but that is a nice, nice yard. Pinky, you could do so much. No, Max and um, Max and Mimi. Oh, they, they they would love to be. Get all this grass pulled over from it What'd she stuff. say? We're able to get all the grass pulled. Girl, you ain't gonna be pull, pulling the grass. Uh, Tim's gonna wait till most of the stuff has died off, and he's gonna take the lawnmower or the, the the rider, and he gonna drive over it a couple times. And that's gonna be it. How in the hell are you gonna pull the grass? You should have done. You should have done it the right way. You should have got a tiller. You could have got some lime. You could have got. You could have gotten the um the the black um um like a garden landscaping um that they have girl you could have done you could have done all that and you would have had a beautiful garden this right here is weed central i think these are little ones so we don't have to worry about it we won't. all right let's go check on him oh hi guys mm, girl that shadow girl <laughs> you look like the liberty bell Seriously, except we know your head is a hell of a lot bigger, but you know sometimes the way shadows come up, but that's what you look like, girl. You look like the damn Liberty, Liberty Bell walking. And I know uh, a few of the Karma family are from Pennsylvania. Uh, any Karma family or just any viewer from Philadelphia or if you're from Pennsylvania, that is no insult uh, to the Liberty Bell. Hey. <laughs> a lot of traffic. 
There's some remains. Uh, yeah, we know uh, there's a lot of traffic. Uh, the Daytona 200. That's why we call it the Daytona 200, Binky, we'll be because it's <laughs> traffic all day long. We'll get in here and get all these picked up. See, that one's all good. Grew right on there. So I'm going to have three. One, two, three, four, five. I'll have five good pumpkins, which I'll be able to do what I need to do. One, two, there's three, four, five, six. I got six watermelons burning in here. It's a hot mess. Well, there, there you go. You said it, Pinky. Uh, it's a hot mess. Um, I would have said it's a hot ass mess, but uh, we'll go with uh, it's a hot mess. At least you acknowledge it. But mm, I will. It'll be all right. I'm gonna show you guys my. Let me show you. This is my pop tree. We planted that from a little tiny baby. If you go back to my videos, you'll see it. Tim did. Is that a tree? I don't know what I don't is that if it's called a pawpaw tree I don't I don't know um or maybe um that's uh CC CC just throwing shit up there on the screen or anything I'm not a tree expert uh you know the way Pinky is so I have no idea what that is just by cutting I don't know what a pawpaw tree is he, this is a pawpaw tree too he be so yeah mm, okay he's going good CC says he's going good poultry so I don't know sometimes I trust uh what CC says because half the time I can't understand what the hell it is that uh, Pinky's trying to say. So, uh, I don't know. It doesn't look like a tree, but I guess it's possible it is a tree. Like I said, I am not a tree expert. Uh, I don't get on here trying to be a tree expert. That's from wood for when it cools down. Yes, we do, finally. Uh, well, boy, that was, uh, yeah, that was interesting. Mm. Well, but at least I'm caught up now. At least I'm caught up and I can take a little time to, uh, you know, watch a, another video here and there. Um, ugh, girl, I don't know. I really, really don't know. Uh, like I was saying about, you know, when you're by yourself, you could walk that beautiful yard, Pinky. You really could. And, you know, y you can, like I said, take some time to reflect. Maybe some ideas would come to your mind. Uh, you know, uh, maybe you could come up with uh, better ideas for um, content. You know, sometimes when we're by ourselves and we just, you know, we reflect Pinky and then ideas and just different things come to our mind. I wish you would really, really consider that, Pinky, because Lord have mercy. I mean, we're going to be coming into fall and the holidays and everything. And, and, and Lord, I don't know if I can take, you know, hey, um, I wanted to bring something up to you all. Uh, that uh, that woman, that Shani for Christ, she back on YouTube somehow. But listen, I have a video from months and months and months ago. But see, then she went off of YouTube and I thought, well, I'm not going to put it up. But I think I'm going to do a react to Shani. So y'all let me know in the comments if, you know, if, you, if you'd like to see something like that. Look here. Someone uh, mentioned, um, I believe it was Mayhem. Uh, this woman here, this was left on one of Pinky's videos, four or five videos ago. Uh, Chastity Clark. Hi, Pink Fairy. That looks yummy. Tomorrow, me and my daughter will be homeless. Please be praying for us. I'm having ramen noodles. I have an application for an apartment. I hope I get it. We love you. Pinky left a heart. Okay, Pinky, you do realize that a heart means you love the comment. What would there be to love about that comment? The woman is saying that her and her daughter are going to be homeless. I don't know. Maybe you just saw noodles, you know, and, and that's why you put the heart there. Um... Listen, I know that people can post comments. They can say anything. You know, it's hard to verify. I don't know if that's true or not. But here's the thing. Pinky, you could have at least taken the time to, you know, leave a nice comment to her. You know, somehow, some way. I mean, if you really got to know your viewers, you know, maybe there are ways to check to see if this woman would be telling the truth. You got 37,000 subscribers, Pinky. I mean, if it were to be true, you could have helped by putting a GoFundMe up for this woman to help her and her daughter out. You know, I'm just throwing some things out there, but I just, I, sometimes I'm amazed that someone can leave a comment or I see someone has left a comment where someone they love has passed away and you leave a heart. What is there to love about homelessness, death, anything like that? Uh, and, and see, this is this is why I continue to have problems with Pinky. Sometimes I step back and I think to myself, maybe I was a little bit hard on her. But see, then I see something like that, and I'm like, no, I wasn't hard on her. Like I said, I just don't. I don't know how you sleep at night sometimes, Pinky. I really don't. It would not have hurt you to to give a heartfelt comment to that lady, you know. But listen, listen, girl, uh, you got to go to sleep. You got to wake up every day. You got to look at yourself in the mirror. And I, I, I cannot believe that you're on Chantel's level. I mean, I, I, I honestly believe that maybe you do think about some of the things that you do. You know, that's what I want to believe because, because I, you know, I, I guess there's still a part of me that wants to believe that that every person has a little bit of good in them, except for Chantel. Except for Chantel. Uh, she just ain't no damn good. She just on all kinds of um, all kinds of levels that you know. 
Uh, I don't want to even explore those levels. But, um, yeah, Pinky, it's just kind of sad to see that um, these are people who are on your channel. They are viewing your videos. They are, um, they are the people who give you that paycheck. And, you know, I don't know. But anyway, uh, that's up to you, Pinky. Like I said, you gotta, you gotta live with this kind of stuff, and um, I just think that's um, really a shame. Uh, listen, Chastity Clark, uh, if you happen to watch this video, uh, listen, girl, uh, you are more than welcome. Listen, you can stay on Pinky's channel, uh, but you are more than welcome in our Karma community. Um, we are a very supportive, loving group of people, very funny, very intelligent people, and you are more than welcome um, on our channel. Karma family, what is it? It's 8.36. I'm gonna get this uh, gonna get this video up, get it out to you. I'm so glad I'm caught up. Um, I still need to come in uh, as far as comments. Um, what I say? What is today? Today's Wednesday. Today is oh, August 23rd. August 23rd. Whoo! Uh, well, uh, we're gonna be going uh, trick or treating here. Uh, well, it it is a while off, but you know, yeah, you go in the stores and everything, you see the Halloween candy and stuff, and I kind of just sometimes chuckle to myself because it's like, uh, y'all know it's still August, right? And I don't like that. I don't like seeing Christmas. That's just like in September. I don't like seeing Christmas decor uh, Christmas decorations out. You know, I just like it's not time. It is not time. But I see people. I I'll be driving somewhere and I see people um, putting out their putting up their Christmas lights. Now these are homes that you know they put out a lot of lights uh, at christmas time too so i guess they have to get started early but anyway that's but you know here i go on and on and on um and there's nothing else there in the comments just that comment right there oh wait a minute. here's this comment that mayhem was saying about new car pinky hey you can sit in the driver's seat and pretend to dr pretend drive turn the wheel back and forth make a beeping sound yeah that's the comment warren that's the comment that uh, Mayhem had said. Of course, the way, uh, the way had Mayhem wrote it and everything, I was laughing my behind off. Hey, listen, Warren, uh, you're welcome over here uh, to the Karma family, too. Um, uh, we need somebody uh, like you. You would fit in very well over here. So any Karma, uh, anyway, Karma family, see, I, I get to rattling on because i got a big mouth. Um, I'm going to get this video up. I hope each and every one of you are having a beautiful week. I love you all, and I will catch you in the next one. Bye, and have a great night.